I like that it says Mug Man when you win as the Mug. How you doing, light bulb? I think you didn't have anything important. Oh, that is something few others can claim. Oh yeah, because he was telling me that the death counter man was there, but I had already talked to him. Let's see how uh, death counter is doing. It's probably in like the 200s at this point. Do all your battles and all my rhymes. You have failed and perished 95 times. We're not going to hit 100, right guys? Look, Mugman's happy. He knows we're good. We can win. Time to do some uh, Funhouse Frazzles. Probably should have actually equipped some of those new shots I had bought. Forgot about them because I was too busy doing a shooty shoot section. Interesting. Honk honk. Duck, duck, uh, duck, duck, duck. Damn it. Yeah, let me just take those hits. Don't worry about it. I'm not prepared to handle this. He's, this duck is annoying. I also feel like I almost got hit there. Okay, yeah, I can slide past it. Yeah. Smooches? Am I even doing damage? I, no, because I'm not hitting the eyeball. And I need to specific. Oh, I did kill it, though. Surprisingly. We ain't torn around with you now, Scram. I guess homing will be good for that, then. Oh! Wasn't aimed. What a fool I am. It's on. It's on. That's all I have to do is dash through this duck. Thankfully, it's like back didn't hurt me. And it's like babies are weak. I don't like the, um... Ooh! I don't like the, like, bit of hop I have when I... I kill you? Leave me alone, Rocket Man! Oh, God! The, like, extra hop you kind of do once you parry the cards. I don't know if it'll cause me to die, but it does scare me. And yes, it will cause me pain. As learned there. What are you? What was that? Oh, I really... I thought that would be up above, but it seemed like it was a different attack. We're close to the end. This isn't too bad. It's a little, little bit messy when we get into the rocket room. But it's not too bad. And begin! And begin! It's on. it's on! I need to really just do the... Jump through the head bit. That was a little... Funky the way I killed it. Mmm! The way that, uh, both those lips were coming at me was a bit stressful. Ooh.
Okay, we're good. We're good. That one needs to go away. Oh, I didn't know you shot at me, buddy. Oh, God. Okay, trumpet man. The way you aim is so weird to me. Um, let me... Shoot. Mmm, very cool. It seems like you really just aim in one direction, so you're easy to deal with. It just sucks that... I took that hit. Okay, thank god I'm close enough to... ...deal with that. I don't even know what... Like, I guess the idea is to... ...use the parry card... Oop, yep. Parry cards to... Not, um... Got that... Oh, no. Please get me out of here. I'm so close. Mm -hmm. Hey, guess what? That, that thing was still behind me. You're up. I'm up. I didn't notice it until it was too late. That had to have been like the last thing though. Okay, it's not too bad dealing with that. I know how to deal with the bois. Don't bother shifting in this room. I mean, I know homing is not a strong uh, shooting style, but I think it comes in handy an awful lot. Especially for, like, I guess I could aim for this guy, but it's a little awkward to... It would be a little awkward to try to do. And I know I can probably parry the... What are they called? What was the game? The, like, jack? You, like, throw the jacks around? Uh, I'm good, though. Health-wise, anyways. Oh, so that's what the uh-oh was for. Still good health-wise. I got scared because I hit his eye wall. I thought it was going to kill me. Did a bang-up job. Didn't get any parries because I didn't parry any actual things like the duck UFO. B-. minus. Mugman's a real B minus kind of guy. Oh, so I think the only thing we have left is the Dragon Tower, which is the other way. 
and then I think we can move on to the next island. Took took me a bit longer than it did uh than it did on the first island, I'll tell you that. Grim matchstick in fiery frolic. Oh my goodness, he's a spooky dragon. Okay. Not the biggest fan of... This seems like this would be a good time for that whole thing where you can drop down. Also, homing seems like it might be useful here. Honestly, at, this seems like shotgun is the worst option. Because of all the motions, I'm just going to do homing for now. I'm probably going to try to switch out. Hoping those smoke clouds don't do damage. Oh, they don't seem to. That uh, tail that came out out of nowhere, though, does. <laughs> it's a stutter. Don't m m m misunderstand my flames, I just mean fun and games. Uh, I'm actually getting rid of shotgun, like, immediately. Um... Homing seems unnecessary. He seems to take up the whole, like, screen. So... Let's see if we can use the lobber. And we'll just do, like, a normal shot. Kind of wish I had the charge shot now, actually. So I don't have to worry about missing attacks. Probably should have had normal shot as my default, but whatever. Don't worry about it. A great slam and then some. Yeah, I know how to switch with those. Lobber seems to have, like, just enough distance to be fine here. Oh, I see the tail now. Ooh! Didn't expect two! Oh, god, I almost fell. Okay. We're going that side. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! God! It's hard to keep track of the little fire gremlins. Ooh! The thing that sucks is they um kind of just go wherever they feel like. Oh, okay. This is just like Hercules. One, two, three. You'd b b better flee. Um. Okay. Lobber is pretty cool. The fact that he's behind the clouds makes me wonder if the boomerang would actually be helpful. Every time I want to just go to that button. Like, I'm not going to do the normal shot. Great coverage with average. I, I, was, I, wanted, I was hoping it had, like, info on the X damage, but whatever. What was variable? Just the uh, end point of his hoop, right? So when he turns around, it might be easier for me, because then I can still move in a direction away from the clouds, since his like nostrils are flaring up. Good day for well Lobber's not bad though. I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. Bit of a forgiving hitbox. Ooh, didn't see the tail. We'll resume. I saw the tail, but it was a little too late. I also would have been safe from the tail if I hadn't panicked. That double is a bit sneaky. Like I said, though, the uh, dodge... Yo, look at that. 
the um, invincibility dodge is great for this. Oh, you still can climb all the way. I'm going to have to do invincibility dodge to avoid that altogether. All right, so the final phase is the Hydra's back, though. Sorry, I didn't mean to put you in the hot seat. I didn't really get a chance to see much of the Hydra back section, so that's a bit of a shame. I'm glad the ceiling doesn't exist. Could you imagine if... If the end of the screen was actually the, like, end of where you could jump? Oh! I didn't think you were going for a twofer. I was too focused on the tail. You can see where the fire guys are aiming. This is great because I don't have to pay too much attention to where I'm aiming. Damn it. They're, like, you can just see the direction that they are attempting to jump. It's a little difficult to keep track of them, though. I also realize I'm not really hitting him, am I? I have to be lower. Uh, that does not work as much as I had hoped it is. Uh, homing, I guess, again would be better. Well, hmm. I, I was able to handle that with Lobber. The thing is, Boomerang might be really good for the final phase, because I think he does take off the whole screen at that point. Hmm, that's a bad hit. I don't like the way Mugman stretches. It frightens me. It's not as cool as Cuphead's, like, steroid use. Ooh! Mmm, I thought that if I tried to dodge through, it would have been a mistake. Great. That's going to be a bit of a problem, too, is outright making sure I stay on the platforms. Ooh! Spooky dragon! Ooh, got a little scared there. Oh, didn't see the clouds for a second. God damn it, I didn't see them. I wish they were easier to notice. Ah, oh, I didn't think you were aiming at me. Okay, I'm gonna boomerang now. Oh! Where did that come from? Then also, I think the flamethrower would have still killed me, but like there was a projectile that came out at the end there. Uh, probably should save my super for that final phase. Seems like the best thing to do. I was trying to uh, parry there, but the cloud got in my way. God, I thought I was going to get hit by that tail. Uh, I thought it, maybe I could... I thought I could have avoided that. I couldn't. The answer was no. God. The thing is, it's pretty random.
who decides to jump sometimes. Alright. Definitely gonna super. I shouldn't have... Oh! How close was I? God, that super didn't even help me much. Uh, boomerang seems like it's still a mistake, so... Stick with the lobber. I don't know if I'm really hitting him much with the boomerang, because like by the time I try to use it, I'm not paying much attention. Boomerang kind of seems lame, actually. Compared to what I was hoping. That was just kind of a weird time for that tail to show up. Damn it! I wish the clouds were just a bit larger. Like, surprise, surprise, a big danger of this fight is that I don't have any solid platform. Which, I mean, kind of was what the problem was with the clown fight a little bit. Not having solid platform for the when the roller coaster part happens made that a lot harder. Damn it, there wasn't anything there. <laughs> I I shouldn't have do, uh, done a dash, though. Close one. Good one. I need to keep in mind that the tail doesn't, like try to track me or anything. Oh, I wanted to parry. I'm going to keep going. I was trying way too hard to parry the... You can technically tell who's going to jump, but it's still not the easiest, although that phase isn't actually that hard either. Mm. Oh, god damn it, I missed the clouds. Yeah, that last phase is a cluster. I'm gonna have to figure out too how to deal with the um, flamethrower bit. I only saw it at the. Close one. I only saw the flamethrower after I had died, so I don't really know what the tell was. Oh god, thank god that cloud was there. Okay. Remember when I said, like, the last phase is usually the easiest? This time it's not so much the case. The worst part about this middle phase... ...is that it's hard to do... ...the most damage possible because he's... ...it's hard to focus. Ooh. Bad place to do this. I'm gonna fall and take damage. Cool. Very cool damage done to me. Probably want to save my super till the end because I don't think I'm gonna be able to really parry anything. So it's like it's not like I'm wasting potential. Oh, I thought I was would be able to get out of that. Here 
I also do have coins. I could try buying the charge shot. This seems like it would be a hard fight to... This seems like it would be a hard fight to actually get the charge shot off, though. At least the part that I'm having trouble with. Because I don't know... Those fireballs are just hard to deal with. I don't know... When I'm safe... God damn it! Hoping maybe you would do one more like eyeball ring. Not bad. If only these bosses didn't have extra phases. Doing a bit better, I think, at multitasking, watching these little fire boys. <gasps> oh, God. The harder thing is also seeing where the clouds are. why they explode. There's that flamethrower. Didn't uh, see when that was coming, but it was. I was going to do a super there, too. I, I don't see the tell because I'm too focused on all the other stuff that's happening. Oh, I thought maybe I would be able to jump in time. Mm. Usually he only goes twice, so I was like, oh, yeah, can't, can't, uh, don't expect him to go again. I shouldn't have assumed he's going again, but this time I'm not in the same spot he was in. No platform. I don't know if I like Mugman's face. Mugman kind of frightens me. And I'm still convinced he's the reason why I'm losing. I feel like I'm just getting real unlucky with these cloud placements. Got a little greedy with that, actually. Oh my god, I'm, I got real lucky with that. I can't believe that one boulder didn't hit me. Fireball, I guess. It's not really a boulder. I also didn't realize until just now that the castle is spinning. It's kind of set up the same way as the genie fight with the... Uh, the pyramid. There's the flamethrower. Shouldn't have done that because I'm going to take dumb damage by being in the ground, please. God damn it. Okay, I did see kind of the tell of the flamethrower attack. I don't know what makes the fireballs explode because that's the big problem. Is when they turn into like additional projectiles. 
So if I can figure that out, or if that could just not happen, that would be super. Uh. I think I might be shooting the fire, and that might make it explode. Kind of is what it looked like there. I could be wrong, I don't really have confidence in that assessment. But I also just don't know what to do about it. Yeah, I think... <laughs> Damn it, I thought I was safe there. If I just don't shoot as often... I had to have been close. Not as close as I would have hoped. Uh, I will say I'm glad I don't have homing shot because I feel like that would probably aim for the fireballs and cause me a lot more problems than they would be worth. Do you think I would be close enough by that point to shotgun? Shotgun would also be pretty bad because the... Uh, it would just hit everything. Charge shot is the only other thing I can think of, but I don't know if I want to use that. Ooh. Ooh, lucky cloud down there. I don't like when multiple decide to, uh... Damn it. That's a bad spot for flamethrower. I want to say he only does it in the middle, and I'm hoping that's the case. Oh! Oh, I was so close. Okay, I, I got this, though. I solved it. Flamethrower seems to be the easiest time to do damage. I just need to have some upper cloud space. I panic jumped. I'm glad I only have to worry about these guys jumping in this phase, though. This phase would be way harder if there was anything else happening. Mmm, didn't see it. Oh, I didn't see the flamethrower! Also, this is a waste of that because I could have used it during this phase. Mm. I shouldn't have done that. I panicked. Mm. God, I can't believe I didn't get hit there. Yeah, surprised I got hit there, huh? Ooh! Good damage. Please. I didn't think I was safe. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I wish I had just like a smidgen of invincibility frames after I do that. Just enough to not suck. That being said, maybe it would be better for me to use the invincible super. I 
can't believe I didn't get hit there. Can't believe I didn't get hit there. I might switch to the invincibility one. It might give me more hits than the beam, and it'll be a bit easier to use, because then I just have to keep shooting in the direction. Good hits, good hits. Please hit. Oh, I was afraid I wasn't going to hit him. Ooh. I was afraid that I was too high up for that last super hit because, you know, I kind of suffered through that when I was trying to do other moves. I only repaired once. Uh... Well, I did it. That was tough, but I, I did enjoy that fight. I just, you know, if I had ground, it would have been super. It would have been a good one. It was still a fine one. Just had me a little more tilted than I had hoped. <laughs> 